Hey everyone, I'm Sarah. And I'm Brandon. And, and this, this is, is Fish or Price, Price Ranch. Ranch. Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm Sarah with Fisher Price Ranch. First off, please don't forget to subscribe and like this video. So, uh, we've had a lot of storms, like small storms, but it gets really warm and then it gets really cold and we're starting to get into a little bit of our windy season. And so, we're going to have to keep a closer eye on the goats because with the sudden weather changes, you'll get a lot of times... Um, you know, the sudden hot, sudden cold, you can get pneumonia with your goats, you can get, you know, snotty noses and things like that. So we want to take care of it as soon as possible. So whenever we have a storm come through and the weather fluctuates so much, we check out the goats every day, twice a day, for at least a week just to make sure nobody's showing any signs of any illness going on. So I went out this morning and I did notice that one of our bucks has a bit of a runny nose and so we're gonna go take care of it. Now um, normally what I would do is give a shot of like vitamin B complex. Um, if it's severe we'll give antibiotics. Um, we had one buck that we purchased and we brought home and ever since we brought him home you know the haul and everything uh, it gave him a snotty nose so we gave him the vitamin B complex and it didn't help the snotty nose persisted so then we decided to go ahead and do antibiotics so we did a round of antibiotics and it still persisted we could not get rid of the snotty nose and after dealing with um, <clears throat> the eye issues that we had and we used the colloidal silver and found out how good that stuff is decided to give him a couple of cc's orally um, to see if that would help and his snotty nose disappeared and he hasn't had one since and that's been months so we're going to test it out on this guy and see how well it's going to work uh, we've not given him any antibiotics we've not given him any vitamin b we're just going to do the colloidal silver and see what that does okay so we had that major storm come through and the temperature went from freezing temperatures up into the 60s and then freezing again and then back up into the 60s so whenever that happens we always watch all the goats for snotty noses well this guy ended up with a snotty nose and so we've tried this before and so we're going to be giving him some colloidal silver just a couple of cc's orally in his mouth get down bud and this is going to help him get better good boy that's it, bud. So we'll be checking on him the next couple of days to make sure that his snotty nose goes away. So now that we've given him the colloidal silver, we're going to be keeping an eye on him over the next few days. Um, so this video will post at the end of the next few days. So we'll give little updates throughout this video and see how he's looking. Uh, we'll do, it's early morning already uh, when we gave him that. So we'll check him out this evening, see how his nose looks. We did not wipe it clean just so we could see. He'll probably wipe it himself on a branch or whatever. Um, but I want to see um, if the snot snotty nose clears up on its own or if we will end up having to treat with something else. Alright, so we're the next day. Excuse you. Uh, since we treated Feldman with the colloidal silver. And today he has no snot on his nose at all. He's a little bit of a wild one. Um, so anyway, it looks like it's working. We'll still keep an eye on him for the next couple days just to be sure that he does not continue with the snotty nose. But so far it looks like he's got a nice clean nose. All right, you guys. Well, it's been a couple of days. I couldn't film um, yesterday because we had 60 plus mile an hour winds and then the rains came which was a blessing. We got um, about a half inch or so of rain. So the ground is soaked, everything's watered. Um, so that's really nice. Uh, but we're gonna go out and check on the buck to see how his nose is looking with all the crazy weather still going on. Make sure that his nose is still clear. Hey boys. Not gonna have to clean up after the wind. It looks like they caught a couple of feed bags here. Here, Feldman. Hey, Bazooka. What are you doing, stinky boy? Feldman, come here. 
Well, there he is. Come here, bud. Come on. He's a little wild, so he's not going to come over easily. But from here, it looks like his nose is actually nice and dry, like it should be. Let's see if we can get him a little closer. There we go. Threw a couple of weeds in here. Yep, his nose is nice and dry. Huh, buddy? Yeah. So it looks like we caught it early enough and that colloidal silver does a great job. Wish we had learned about it sooner. All right, you guys, well, I hope you found this helpful and uh, hopefully it'll maybe help save a, one of your goats from getting sick down the future. Um, I'm sure we can use it on multiple animals because it's all natural. Um, and so anyway, it's worked with the eye issues we've had and now it's worked with early signs of a cold. Hopefully it was, uh, if it was early signs of pneumonia, it definitely cleared it right up. So pretty excited about that. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you again soon.